You try and be a good boyfriend and get front row seats to a concert with your girl, and all of a sudden he invites her on stage. Dropping a curtain. <laughs> Look at what's going on. What is her face down in that area for? She's in a relationship. Why is her head there? Come on. This artist Amale was throwing a concert, and this lady right here was attending a concert front row with her boyfriend, and she proceeds to get invited on stage and when she got invited on stage what happens on that stage during a performance goes insanely viral all over my social media that I've been seeing it for the past week what is they doing look at what's going on in front of the whole audience this is insane Boyfriend, this is him. He's shaking his head. Everybody's laughing at how the security is now pointing. The security. He's still up there stroking. How is he still going? How is it still happening? The lights was dark and dim. Look, the lights came on, the camera cut. Everybody laughing at him. We can't, we go back to the stage. He's still up there stroking. Bang, bang, bang. He having the time of his life with this man's girlfriend. He getting paid to steal a girl. Raggedy jury curl bitch, I would be up there whooping a performer's ass. And you would have thought Will Smith was a saint, the things I would have did to this man. I would have bust him upside the head with that microphone he's singing with. You want to be performing? I'm going to give you a show. You want to play around? Well, let's play. What is wrong with these people? Out here spending my money. I'm going to get my money worth. Since I can't enjoy the show, I'm paying for an ass whooping. Are you dumb? He getting paid to be up there. Now you a paid performer to fight. You a boxer now. We fighting. He a paid fighter. He better know how to fight back because I'm swinging on his dumb ass. To make the situation worse, people are now laughing at my man. <laughs> he can't even. The event is over. He can't even go home. He just laughed. They're laughing at him in the street. God. <laughs> How are they following him with cameras laughing? The show is over. Let's see, this your eyes wasn't that bad. It was that bad, girl. Like, bro, you, you, were, you were holding the nigga's dick. <laughs> Look at how many people holding cameras up in his direction. <laughs> Damn, bro. I could understand people in his section thought it was funny, but how did that many people know it was him from the show? How they know his girl the one that got took, and why they laughing at him for his girl being a bop? How they ruining his reputation? Where's the the girl should be the one getting laughed at? How where's she at? Don't tell me she get to go home safely while he being humiliated all in the social media. Why was she even doing this? Look at how he rubbing up. She was on go from the second she got up there. Did they rehearse this? She is, she doing such a good job. You would have thought she was a part of the rehearsal. Oh 
my goodness. What is he doing? Is he unbuckling? He taking clothes off. You wouldn't have been the only one, buddy, because I'm whooping your ass. Look you up. Earn money and you up here bumping and growing. Oh my man, better man than me. I'm jumping the barricade. I look to my left, I see security pointing and laughing at me. They gonna be having to catch me because I'm chasing. Are you out your mind playing too much? Look at them, look at them, look at them. Y'all caressing that raggedy hair. Look at what he doing. It's freaky self, man. Chat, they doing the X-rated stuff. Swear to goodness, man. This man doing all that extra stuff with his girl. Let that would have been me. I would have went up there and showed him how to do it. How long is this segment? There's no need for that part of the show to be that long. He said we're living through the great recession of good women. That girl jumped right into that stage and became the number one dancer in the fucking world, man. Imagine. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got here. He just paid his ticket like everybody else and tried to enjoy a show. And now he the laughing stop. Now he's being laughed at all over social media. The girlies is about to hate what I'm about to say. Because yes, I'm a girl's girl, but I'm all for right is right and wrong is wrong. And the way that girl got up on stage and danced with that man, knowing her boyfriend was in the crowd, she was dead wrong. You're cruel. That's so messed up and karma is going to eat you up. Honestly, I'm glad that everybody is on the same page that this is just unacceptable behavior. That girl lost her mind jumping up on that stage and acting the way she did. Because that was ridiculous that even the security guards was pointing at him. It's ridiculous that they were even laughing at him on his way home. It's just a all around weird situation that nobody should have to go through when you're just trying to pay your tickets to show up to a show and your girl end up leaving with another man. Like even if he's the performer of the show, that is absolutely unacceptable to be acting like that and doing that. That is so weird, bro. That girl is disgusting for carrying on like that. And they're going to drop the curtain. I don't even want to talk about it because just thinking about it re-pissing me off. I've been seeing that all over my social media for the past week, but I just decided to watch it now and it made me just as mad as I thought it was. I let it slide so many times, but it just kept popping up. It kept, it kept getting more attention, more attention, more. I said, you know what? Now I got to speak on it. I keep my ear to the street so much that I keep hearing the same thing over and over. That's when I decide to speak on it. Let me know what you would have done in this situation if this happened to you. Because I just told y'all what I would have did. We jump in barricade and we, yeah, that curtain, I'm ripping that down and we getting action started. I'm telling you. Let me know down in the comments what you would have done in that situation.